I want to say to all the young women out there, there are going to be people along the way who will try to undercut your success or take credit for your accomplishments or your fame. But if you just focus on the work and you don't let those people sidetrack you, someday when you get where you're going, you'll look around and you will know that it was you and the people who love you who put you there. And that will be the greatest feeling in the world. Thank you. It's a scam or she should film a school vlog but like reality version because this shit in what school is can I say shit? okay but subscribe she very cool bye, -bye. <laughs> bye. zero mood to study and I have a freaking H3 test tomorrow I'm so freaking tired from CCA I'm gonna try to study la Spectroscopy and molecular orbital theory notes. Like, look at this. This is so satisfying, eh? And UV. I also have a H2 practical time practice tomorrow. I have not studied. <laughs> this is so Yeah, this smells so good eh. Also, I'm having a headache right now, so I'm putting this on my temples. Tuesday, which means it is chem day, inserting my timetable over here. Heart to heart talks with hydrochloric. I don't know if people relate. You know when you study, you actually have to think, right? I guess when I study, it just stops me from thinking about everything else. Okay, I'll put the username of the post. Basically, it reads, Feeling the need to be busy all the time is a trauma response and a fear-based distraction from what you would be forced to acknowledge and feel if you slowed down. And the caption goes, Being busy allows you no time to stop, to think, to be still, to be with yourself, your thoughts or your fears. Being busy is often a badge worn with pride, lauded and applauded by how much we have achieved, the energy we have given or time spent. Society supports busy, harder, faster, more, but at what cost? You cannot outwork, outrun, outscroll, outnumb yourself. And I hope that you seek safety in stillness, so that you may find the support and courage to allow you to address your wounds and heal, rather than constantly dressing in them in distraction. 
Reading this post was like a call out. I loved being busy because it didn't give me the time to overthink, to feel all these shitty emotions, to even like feel emotions in general. Like I just feel happy because I'm so productive. And honestly, I wonder how far that's gonna take me. Like, is it really that bad of a thing? Or is it really that bad of a thing to not slow down? Okay, anyway, it's currently 12.34. I am going to wake up early tomorrow to study for my inorganic QA time practice, I guess. was a disaster. If I passed, I would be over the moon. Um, I'm eating instant noodles. So I'm gonna be editing my vlog. <laughs> SSW is. That's a very bad camera angle. I'm so sorry. But yeah, literally every part of the school is crowded. Okay, hello. It's 
it's Friday morning and I think I'm going to stop my vlog here because today is going to be a very very long day. Anyway, I hope you all also had an amazing week, even though mine wasn't like the best. But um, I didn't have the best week, but I have to say that my friends made it like 1000 times better. Um, yeah, so remember to stay happy, stay productive, but also take care of your health. Okay, see you in my next video. Bye-bye! Thank <music> you.